Hello, I'm Jeffrey Kay. I'm an actor and a retired surgical sales executive living in Brentwood, California. My wife Marie and I grow some grapes out in our backyard. And quite frankly, we were looking for a way to use those grapes in making some home wine. So I did a little research and I found that there's this guru by the name of Tim Vandergrift. Now Tim is a master winemaker and he blogs on everything that has to do with home winemaking. He recommended the Master Vintner Kit. So I decided to give it a shot and this is my review. One of the awesome things about this particular kit is the fact that it is so comprehensive. It has everything that you need, all the tools that you require to make wine from grapes to the finished product. So a little bit more about some of the, the, the advantage of this, this particular kit is just the quality of the products that you get in here. All the way from the quality of the brushes themselves to thermometers that come with the kit, corks, everything. These are all high quality product and so this is one of the reasons why I chose this particular kit. Now one of the things that I really like about this is the fact that it has this glass uh, carboy. The carboy basically will allow you to put your wine product in there, let it ferment and it will sit there and age as long as you possibly want it to without fear of oxidation. Okay. Now, this other container over here is what they call the Big Mouth Bubbler. What I like about this particular product is the fact that it will allow you to start your wine here. This is where you start your fermentation process and then switch it over to the carboy. Real, real superior product healing here. Uh, it has just about everything that you, you could possibly use. This particular product, which is really nice, this is called the degasser or the wine whip for obvious reasons. But this allows you to keep your wine from uh, gassing up on you. So this is something that you won't find in a lot of the kits out there. Now, we've talked about, of course, making the wine. What about the taste? Oh my, that came out pretty good. I gotta tell you, it's bright. It's fruity. It tastes like what you want a good bottle of wine to taste like. So quite frankly, I'm going to be pleased with this. My wife's going to be pleased with it as well. So we can't lose. Okay. I've given you some of the pros. Let's be honest and talk about some of the cons. Now, some of the kits that are out there are made in China. And the downside of that is that they might come in cheap, but this particular kit is made in the United States and it is all quality. Now, one of the, the concerns that I had had to do with the fact that the Big Mouth Bubbler is made of plastic. Now, it's a good high quality plastic, but I was worried about BPA. Now, BPA is a chemical that can be released from certain plastics and it's not really good for human consumption. But I got to tell you, what I call the guys at Northern Brewer, the tech support guys are there seven days a week. They reassured me within minutes of my call that there is absolutely no BPA release from this plastic. And that made me feel a lot better. So this tells me that I can now start the fermentation process of making my wine in the Big Mouth Bubbler and then switch it over to the carboy. And the carboy is made of good high quality glass. Now the beauty of this is you can put your wine in here and age it for as long as you wish without any fear of oxidation. And that's a real advantage. So after talking about the pros and the cons and the whole thing here, I'm giving this kit a 4.9 rating and I think it's worth it. So I hope you guys found this review helpful and I wish you well. Cheers.